Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It's your boy Kovac here, and for this one, I will be doing a pet spotlight on Smoochums. Now, Smoochums, I have been wanting to get my hand on this pet for the longest time since uh, BFA has came out, anyway, and since I've been back a while for two reasons, two main reasons. Okay, first reason: look at that beautiful beautiful undead kin. I mean, who who wouldn't want that? Who would not want that? Alright, that's number uh, reason number one. Reason number two is Smoochums has got this uh, interesting ability right here called Tea Party, and it's a spammable ability. It's undead, and it's AoE. It does 108 to uh, every pet, and I wanted to see how it was like. And uh, if it's really good, I'm thinking this pet is going to be Tier 1, without a doubt. Kind of like how we Abomination was able to spam Cleave. Except Cleave is different from Tea Party. Tea Party does that amount of damage regardless of how many pets are out. So if there's only one, 108. But uh, Cleave is different. It's a uh, evenly split. If there's only one pet out, it does more damage. So, <clears throat> yeah, I wanted to try out Tea Party. Seems like a pretty interesting ability. And uh, someone does not want to accept a cube for some unfortunate reason. Uh, well, I guess we can go ahead and summon out Smoochums. Take a closer look at them. Look at that beautiful cat. Oh, look at him. Who could not want that? Now... <clears throat> As far as getting Smoochums goes, you either pay uh, 200 Polish Pet Charms, which can be quite an expense, I'll admit, and it's from Nigel Rifthold and Drust Bar, or you can get them off the auction house, but Smoochums, Smoochums, I was about to say Smoochums, but uh, Smoochums can be quite the pretty penny usually selling anywhere from uh, 20 to sometimes a little over 30k gold but luckily uh, last night I was just on the auction house skimming through it and some someone literally just instantly put a smoochums up for 15k gold and I was like done deal I'll definitely take it for that much I think I got a pretty good uh, pretty good deal with it Oh, and this team, Gary's Tea Party. It's pretty much named that because of Tea Party, and my uh, my snail's name is Gary. So, and then a uh, a tier one pet on the team. I I don't know if I would call Smoochums tier one yet. I want to. I really do. But um, we we'll just have to see how well it does. But uh, uh, where where's my opponent? Who who queued up for a pet battle? Anyone? Anyone at all? Nope. Okay then. I get. I guess not, guys. No one wants to pet back. That's been happening a lot lately. Uh, whenever I go to record and I queue up for a battle, and then no one shows up, and it's usually only when I record too. Uh, when it's like just me testing the waters or whatever. We're having some fun with teams. Usually there's always someone there. <coughs> I don't know what that's all about. But hopefully. Oh yeah, we're good now. We're good. <coughs> and Smoochums is really good against freaking... Uh, I'd say pretty good against like Tunkins and stuff. Because he's faster. So that's good. I'd say I'd have a pretty good matchup. So I'm going to go start out with Twilight Clutch Sister. And like do the all usual. See if we can't get him to uh go for a conflict right here. We sure did. Um I'll go for a another Twilight Fire. That should bring him below his uh fifty percent. No, it didn't, okay, whatever. Still gonna go for Twilight Meteor, right? Regardless. Okay, he does have Jab. 
Uh, I'm gonna go for Twilight Fire anyway. <clears throat> In case he swapped out, you know. Alright, I'm dead right there. He died as well. Uh, it really depends on who he brings in next. If he brings in the Gilnean Raven, my snail's great against it, but if he brings in Tonkins, Smoochums is going to do good. Come on, bring in Tonkins. Yes, that's exactly who I wanted him to bring in. Alright, um, I reckon I'll go for that straight up 386 with Blood Fang, because it's good damage. Oh, you went for another gate. Oh, it's probably because I was faster anyway. Well, I mean, I'm still going to, uh, probably still going to switch back into Smoochums. Because while I got a Jar of Smelly Liquid, I'll just go for a Tea Party. And then I can use Absorb to basically heal up. Oh, that ability basically works like, um, what's that pet called? It's a humanoid. Sunborn Valkyr with, uh, was it Omni Slash? Yeah, it wait it works just like that. So it'll break like a decoy, basically. That's interesting. Well, dang, I thought it was gonna work like Cleave. Never mind. Still pretty interesting ability, I'd have to say. Uh, let's see. I could go for Absorb, but probably maybe live another turn. Oh yeah, totally, especially since he decided to go for that. Um, <clears throat> Blood Fang hits the hardest, and he probably might switch me out anyway. Oh, he didn't. Okay. I see ya. Uh, in case he doesn't switch me out, I'll go for Tea Party. Yeah, he did. Okay. Alrighty, go for that, and I'll go ahead and dive, because when I'm dived, he won't be able to hit me with Jar of Smelly Liquid, and I'll do extra damage. He's going to die right here if he doesn't switch. That is just straight up fact. Uh, I don't know if this I'm going to be enough to like kill this uh, raven. Oh, I mean, especially with that crit right there. Yep, not going to be able to, basically, because of that crit. <clears throat> um, didn't do too half bad. It's interesting to know that Tea Party works like a Sunborn Valkyrs one ability. Uh, I, I, don't, I don't think I'd uh, call it Tier 1, then. I don't know. It's, it seems like it might, it might be a high Tier 2, maybe. Maybe. I mean, it is undead, so it's got that going for it. Um, let's go with this team. It's an all undead team. Uh, this can count towards your your all undead family brawler teammate if you don't have that already. If maybe you want to use Smoochums, but uh, I just paired them with uh two other pretty good undeads. Frostwolf Ghost Plus, just a really solid pet, and Detective Ray. You kind of want to diversify your damage with undeads because the Emperor Crab will ruin your day. Alrighty. <clears throat> Obviously, Tonkins is going to be the biggest bane. It's too bad I don't have undead damage on Detective Ray, but might be fine. Okay. Let's go for Smoochums. Because last time he did start out with Harbinger of Flame. Should I just spam Tea Party? Sure, let's uh let's go for it. This is gonna do extra damage to two of his pets. <clears throat> and it's a not bad oh um uh spamble AoE, I can't get the words out. Okay, he went straight for that yet again. Go for Blood Fang right here. Just to get that uh that big damage right there, because I'm probably gonna die right here anyway. And another tea party. Okie dokie. I've done quite a bit of damage all around. Let's see. 
bring in the ghost pup, I guess. I mean, I have a terrible matchup due to the fact I have Scratch, but hopefully I can go first right here before he gets off an attack. Oh, no, of course. Alright, Blizzard, just uh, screw me over twice. I mean, it's bad enough that he has uh, tongue pins. <clears throat> he brings in Tunkins right now, that's just going to ruin my day. Um, I do weak damage. He might switch me out right here. Why would you go for Jar Smelly Liquid? I mean, I was, I was stunned and slower than you. Do you not know how to use Tunkins? Is that it? I get it. I get it if you don't know how to use Tonkins. You can use a OP pet and, uh, you know, just not know how to use it right, I guess. But oh well. Uh, let's see. Uh, I'm faster than you. I'm gonna go for a flame jet to get that off. No burn, unfortunately. Uh, it's really too bad I don't have Skull Toss right here, otherwise I'd probably eat you a new one, Tonkins. <clears throat> Damn you, Tonkins, you overpowered pet. Uh, if I hit on the higher end, he's dead. Alright, I killed Tonkins. Mission success. Lose is imminent. So yeah, there's that. <laughs> Poor Detective Ray. Come on, Detective Ray, just super crit right here and you'll kill this crow. Even though there's no such thing as a super crit. Alright. Alright, well, my next team will be a bit better in case if uh, that guy decides to queue up again. Uh, I mean, I got better pets <clears throat> to deal with, uh, frickin' Tunkins. Here we go. Maybe I'll get him. Oh, no. Okay. Different team. He's got an Alliance Enthusiast, though. Which can be kind of worse than Tunkins due to the fact it has about a hundred or so more health. So, yeah... He's got really two, uh, three really good pets, but I got three pretty good pets as well. <clears throat> and he started out with it too. Lovely. I'll go ahead and switch you out now. Okie dokie. Let's go ahead and throw up immolation then. Haha, you only landed one of them. Alright, Smoochums. I'll probably save Smoochums for this guy. So, let's go ahead and bring in my uh, Ventral Porky Pet. Ah, crap. Well, I mean, at least I can Powerball right here. Too bad I'm not faster. It's because he's got the SS Breed, which is a breed that I use nowadays. I believe it's the best one out of all of them, personally. Uh, I can go ahead and Spirit Spikes right here. And, uh, ooh, going to take very uh, weak damage from that. Let's see, I'm faster than all of the pets now. I'm not going to take any damage from Bone Barrage, which is nice. And now, thanks to him not interweaving his abilities, he is not going to be able to uh, do anything to me right now. Which isn't how you should play a Bone Serpent, by the way. Oh, he brought in his other undead. That's lovely. Ooh, I would have loved a triple flank right there, uh, Hiru. My, uh, ventral porcupet. But you didn't give that to me. Plus, he got a stun, so. That's bad. Um, I might go ahead and go in the smooch right now. Oh, wait, I forgot this guy's got an AoE. That probably wasn't the smartest idea. Crap. That AoE is enough to kill him, by the way. No! Poor Ventral Porky. I mean, he was gonna die either way. That was always that chance he wasn't going to do his AoE. Alright, Bloodfang. 
Alright, let's just spam tea party like no tomorrow. Let's see, how much damage does this do to him now? Uh, I'll go for an absorb right here. I mean, it'll kill him. Plus, it give me a little bit of a heal. I'll be able to uh, live that soul rush. Nice, it didn't stun either. Alright, absorb. <clears throat> Thank you for your health donation, Fragment of Anger. I will happily take it. Now, his Enthusias is quite low on health. Uh, let's see. Blood Fang will do the most damage right here in this situation. Uh, I think I'll... I, mean, I might... I was thinking about saving Smoochums. I might not have to. Me, I know it would be kind of funny if he freaking went for Jar Smelly Liquid right here. That would be freaking hilarious. His best bet would be to like either. Oh, he passed. He could have attacked and got his like humanoid racial at the very least. But I, I mean, you do what you want, friend. I mean, you're not my friend, but like, you know what I mean. Oh, your Jar Smelly Liquid isn't gonna save you this time. Nope, nope, no it's not. Oh crap, well damage goes first I think. Yep, goodbye. That's one scum down the drain. <coughs> Smoochums for the win. Let's see, how are you looking on time? Alright, I probably could do another one or so. Man, I would really love to play one of these other teams. But I'll play with this team again. Oh, and the move set you probably want to do with Smoochums. Uh, I don't really like a Rabbit Strike, so Absorb is usually the way to go. Um, prowl? Yeah, I don't. I don't really recommend it. I mean, where are you gonna prowl? An Absorb? Uh, prowling a Tea Party is not gonna be good because uh, it does its damage to each pet and two attacks. So you'd only be buffing the first hit of Tea Party to the first pet. And that time is basically like a hibernate, so I recommend just sticking with Tea Party anyway. Huh. Man, come on. I could be playing one of the other teams right now. <sighs> Man. Well, I mean... He doesn't have half bad pets, so... You know what I'll do? I'll just stay on my fiendish imp until he dies. I will let you kill my pet. I'm not gonna switch you out or anything, pal. I mean, that's just insane. You, uh, fight that one guy, and then you, you queue up against someone else that has, uh, less than used teams that you don't see very often. Well, what happened? Did I get an achievement? Uh, looks like the guild got an achievement or something. Okay. Alrighty, he killed me right there. Um, I'll just go into Vengeful Porcupet. But a lot of my good friends and uh, fellow people in Discord have been talking about, and I agree too. That Blizzard should just go ahead and merge all the battle groups together. I mean, obviously not US and EU, because that would be a cluster. Like, I mean, EU have all theirs mixed, and US have all theirs mixed. That way, you can have more fun battles, instead of going against the same guy over and over again, and probably see YouTubers go against each other more often, because... The only two pet battle YouTubers I see go against each other because they're in the same meta is uh, Disco Doggy as well as uh, Lenica. I would, God, I would love to be in their meta. That would be so awesome. But uh, alas, I'm just all by myself. I don't have anyone in my meta, which is unfortunate. <clears throat> yeah, I just wish Blizzard would uh, just go ahead and merge them all already. I mean, I would hope it not wouldn't be a big cluster or something like that. You probably would get 
faster queues, maybe even instant queues, but um but yeah, I just I just wish that uh there'd be some sort of change to that. Alright, he killed my second pet. Alright, I guess uh Smoochums will have to clean it up. He's actually faster than me too, huh? This isn't a pet that you see very often. It does have strong damage versus me. Uh oh. Am I going to lose this? Huh. That'd be kind of funny if I did. Oh, he stunned me. Oh, crap. <laughs> oh, no, he's going to win. Well, I'll let him have that win. I mean, I'll let him, uh,. It take that victory with joy. I mean, I wasn't going to like beat up on him, use Nether Gate and all that stuff. I mean, good job to him. I I thought I was still going to win, regardless of me just uh, you know, just not playing optimally, like how you would usually play a fiendish champ. So yeah, um, I'm glad he won because at least he doesn't feel like he's getting beat up or something. So that's good. It makes me feel good. I don't even care that I lost, honestly. I would only care if I lost if it was like against Swarmy Tunkins or something like that. I mean, at least we're seeing some different pets now. That's good. Oh, oh, what? What? Why would you run away? I don't have... I mean, I have a snail. I literally have a snail on my team. And you ran away. Wow, okay, I mean... Technically a win, but not the kind of win I would like to get. Smoochums, I guess you're just scaring people off by the, by how beautiful you look. I mean, look at that cat. Oh, look at him. <clears throat> but yeah, I, I kind of, I really wish that uh, Blizzard would just go ahead, merge both like US, all the US ones together, and then all the EU ones together. Because I know. In EU, I'm pretty sure in EU, it is a lot worse in their meta, at least from what I hear from Roscoe. Like, back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back spamming of, like, Tunkins or whatever, or, like, Twilight Clutch Sisters and all that jazz. And even, uh, Poda and Trunks, because that is a very good duo right there, Poda and Trunks. But, uh, yeah, I, I just want to see them all merged. It would be a lot better for the pet battle community, I think, anyways. Who knows? Maybe we'll see something happen. <coughs> oh, smoke drums. Hopefully they don't run away this time. I mean, I would like to... What? 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 Oh, come on, pet battles. What is going on with you today? <laughs> Literally only when I go to record. It usually doesn't even happen whenever I'm just, like, having fun off camera. <sighs> I guess that's just the way of the pet battle gods, I suppose. Alright, here we go. Hopefully this is the one. Oh no! Rotten little helper! <laughs> Why? Why you do this? Okay. Yeah, I figured he'd do that first. Gonna go ahead and dodge. Nice. Um, thankfully they don't have a whole lot of health. Oh, he's not letting me. I was going to activate my racial off that one. Uh, Twilight Clutch Sister will still be able to do a crap ton of damage. Oh man, another crit. Um, I will save my Clutch Sister for later, and this snail is probably the perfect pet to uh, suck up this minefield, and I believe the damage is going to go off first anyway. 
Ah, oh, damn, he lived. He might throw down another minefield. Because he's going to die right here. So I'll go for a dive. Nicely done, nicely done. Alright, he's not going to hit me right here. I mean, all he can really do... Well, I guess, yeah, you could take it. Alright. Not looking bad right here, honestly. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and bring in Smoochums, even though ideally it'd probably be better to bring in the other pet, but I'm faster, so I can go for an Absorb. Good stuff right there. Oh crap, if I don't kill this rotten little helper. <gasps> or, what I can do, I hope he goes for booby trap presents right here. Come on, go for it. Ah, oh, damn, I mean, at least I soaked that hit. At least I did, because that's good. But, uh, what I was hoping to do... Was to frickin' get him to throw that down and then I could dodge and do my AoE and stuff. Question is, am I going to be able to outheal the damage that he's doing? If he gets any crits, then no. I have to kill him before Grinch's gift comes back. Um, not enough yet. Alright, I think I'll be able to take him down right here. Oh, yes. Good. Alright, Blood Fang will kill him, and plus I'll heal up too. Ha ha ha. <laughs> a win against this guy is always a good win. Because a uh, rot triple rotten little helper, that is quite the pickle to deal with. Triple the minefield and triple the Grinch's gift. I guess that worked out that I uh, took that hit on Twilight Clutch Sister anyway, so. That's good. Uh, let's see, how are we looking for time? I might do a one more battle. And I'll go ahead and keep it up with this team, I suppose. At least I know it can win against uh, Triple Rotten Little Helper. That's good. That's really good. <clears throat> Smoochums, you are just doing swimmingly well. Despite uh, a couple of losses, <sighs> I just I just love this pet. I couldn't wait to get this pet and do a video on it. Summon you out. Look at him. He makes like that little meow noise. Look at his face. Such a beautiful cat. Not to mention he's undead. Um, there's like a couple of other undead cats that are pretty good too. I'd say Smoochums is decent. I might play around with them in some fun teams during the Critter event, which is almost upon us. Once again. Yep, the 2nd of April will be the next Pet Battle bonus event. And, uh... Guarantee there will be a crap ton of videos coming from me during that time. Cause I absolutely love that event. Uh, get to see all those creative and different teams out there. You'll still see like people running pumpkins and bone serpents and the noob sap idols and all that jazz. But uh, during that time, it's all about having fun. Queuing it up with uh, not very used pets, like for example, Smoochums. I've never gone against Smoochums before. So, for all these people, it must be like, wow, I wonder what that pet does. I've never seen it in PvP pet battles. So, yeah, I can't wait for that critter event. Wow, I, what <laughs> what is the point? Of clicking find battle and you just decline it so many times. I don't know. Uh, are you like, was the baby crying? Uh, did your boss call you or something? Or what? What, uh, what prevented you from entering the pet battle? Oh, it sounded like Smoochin just hissed at me. 
Calm down, little kitty. Oh, I wonder, I wonder, since Smoochums is a cat, there's a little trick. If you target, like, a cat and type slash sit, Oh, it totally does. That's awesome. Oh, look at him. <laughs> oh, that's so amazing. Yeah, because with cats, and maybe dogs too, I'm not sure, but I believe it's all cats and WoW. Pet, bat uh, battle pets anyway. If you target them and type slash sit, uh, they will come over. Oh, that was a transport. <laughs> Did y'all see that? How was I in a transport? The only other time that pops up is when you're in that little uh, heirloom mount and you try to do a pet battle. I didn't know you can't accept it while sitting down. Damn, that's too bad. <laughs> but uh, how was that a vehicle while I was sitting down? That's pretty cool to know that uh, you could sit down and have your little smoochums come and sit in your lap. Good stuff. Hopefully we can get into one more battle. I would love to. Oh man, come on. <laughs> come on, people. You know you want to pet battle me. Another decline. All right. Oh, finally, here we go into a battle. Finally. Oh, no, it's this guy. Oh, come on. Ugh. Man. I'm not even faster on Twilight Clutch Sister than Bone Serpent. Last time he started out with it, so I'll go with the Mudshell Conch. Alright, good. Alright, he, um... Last time he went straight up in the air with left off, so maybe I can get that to happen again. Oh, nice. I'll be able to dodge his left off and I'll do extra damage when I die because he's got acidic goo on him. That's good. Uh oh. Here comes darkness. Please don't miss Gary. Alright, good. Okie dokie. Uh, do I want to save Gary for anything? I don't know. Probably. He probably will bring in that fragment of anger next, like he did last time. I can only assume. I hope he does. I mean, at least I can't get stunned. Nice. Very nice. I'll get acidic goo on you. Alright. He might go for his AOE. No, he didn't. Okay. That is fine and dandy. I'll go for uh, Twilight Clutch Sister right here. Ooh, Dragon Racial. Alright, well I'll go for that then. 
Nice, none of them missed either. That's really good for me. And I'll be able to go for a dodge right here, and I am faster than the Enthusiast, so that's really good for me. I'll probably just throw out my Twilight Fire. Ooh, I got my Racial too, awesome. And I'll probably just switch out. What? <laughs> what a bot. What a bot. Why would you go for that? I was literally dodged. Hilarious. Well, I win. I mean, regardless of that. Dude, what a bot. Why would you go for a jar while I was dodged? You could clearly see that I was dodged. I just don't understand people who play OP pets and don't know how to use them right. But, um, yeah, I think that will be it for this one, friends. Uh, yeah, smoochums. Just really wanted to uh, do a video on this pet. I've really been looking forward to it. It's a beautiful pet. Just a little undead kitten. Again, if you want to drop a big deposit of 200 polished pet charms, you're more than welcome to. Not sure if there's any quests involved before you can go to the vendor. You'll just have to look that up. Or you can get it off the auction house, but you'll probably be spending quite a chunk of gold, as I did. But, um, yeah. That'll wrap it up for this one. Really hope you guys enjoyed. This is Kovac, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.